Well, SoCal SC just wrapped up their match against Coras USA here in Riverside. We got Brian Orta here on SoCal SC TV. And Brian, wow, it, the match finished eight against seven. <laughs> I can't even count how many red cards, yellow cards. Unfortunately, it was, a, it was a one nil setback for your side, but have you ever seen anything like this? No, of course not. This is uh, ridiculous. You know, you usually see a red two at the most, but the ref just went over the top and uh, didn't know how to control the game, so he just started throwing out cards to try to regulate. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I feel like you guys were playing a good match until the point where it kind of all unraveled. Koros got that goal, but you still had numbers. You still were attacking the net. You still had opportunities to find that equalizer. Yes, of course. You know, when you're up a man, you're moving the ball, you're flowing. You want to keep it until we create more opportunities. You know, the, the red card came, and I think we kind of panicked. Uh, at the bench, we panicked a little bit, and it just kind of went downhill from there. What do you guys have to do to kind of regroup and get that mental toughness to kind of focus on that next match and keep that playoff hope alive? It might be slim now, but to still keep that hope alive. Overall, we have to be positive as a team. You know, these red cards obviously affect everybody. Next game, we're going to have a, like four players missing, yeah. and the, the roster keeps getting thinner and thinner with injuries. But I think positivity more than anything and uh, keeping the hope alive because you never know what can happen. You know, this game is that's in, in sports. You never know what's gonna, what can happen. And uh, if we stay positive and do our best and we're coming every day and work hard, uh, there's no telling what we can do. All right, that's Brian Orta here on SoCal SC TV.